Hello Facebook, YouTube. Well, you know, God told me to do this message and uh well I'm here being a minister is all about pretty much presenting information. You know, it's not so much about a course uh that people think it's like shoving something down somebody's throat. But no, it's about presenting something to make really pretty much make people aware of something you know that they may not be aware of it's like any just like any information you know but this is ministering something that is about your life and eternal life yeah that other stuff is about your life you know but this is eternal too but I'm going to present something, you know, that people need to understand about uh, love. That God was talking to me about that love is something. Uh, uh, love is the topic of the message is talking about love is in energy. Yeah, is that, you know, simple. The reality love is in energy. Now. Why is it important to know that love is an energy? Well, here's the thing. Because the thing is, um, it's to make it more simple. To make it that make it more simple because people have a good idea about energy and how it works. That you just let energy tell you what love is all about. Now, as you know, I hope everybody did their, know their science that we are created by light. And light created uh, by many atoms, atoms that are forms of energy concerning the nucleus of protons and electrons. Oh, sorry, protons and neutrons that create electrons that forms the atom. Now, in that system, as you know, if you check out an atom, is in it has to be in a uh, agreement that's what a, agreement of the opposite or more likely agreement of something different that's what I hope you get the idea of agreement of two different things now yeah it's what I said a proton and a neutron these are two different things Things that comes in agreement that will create a nucleus that creates the atom, that creates an atom that will produce matter, that produce matter that will create light and light that creates everything, you know, courtesy of God and His Son Jesus Christ. But anyway, but now here's the thing that you need to understand about that now. Uh, here, now, I, I'm finna, um, homosexuals. Hmm. Uh, the ideal of that, uh, reality, that ideal, I don't know about reality, but ideal of that when, now, like I said, in order for true fusion to come together, it has to come together it has to be different, you know, or more likely they talk about like male, female. These are two different uh, beings. And the thing is, these different beings can only come up with the proper uh, are created to produce as what God says that to replenish the earth. You know, he said, well, you know, um, multiply the earth. He told, you know, Adam, Eve to multiply the earth. It can only produce energy that will produce production concerning babies and that grows up to be human beings, uh, adults. And the thing is, that is a proper energy based upon the dynamics of, like I said, creation Based upon the proton and the, uh, I mean, the, the, yeah, the proton and the neutron. It needs that, according to science, know that. Now, the thing is, 
Here's the thing. You know, now I went science on y'all. Now I'm finna go simple science. Well, for everybody. Well, and you have batteries. Batteries, in order for a car or any energy to be stored and utilized properly according to batteries, you will have to have a negative charge and a positive charge. Two different Things negative positive charge has to come together to unite to create an energy, you know what I'm saying? And the thing is, and I'm gonna go to races. Ha ha ha, look at that. Races are different skin colors, different types of people from different ethnic, you know, backgrounds. You know, the interesting about what God revealed to me about. Uh, races and the ridiculous racism that you know that they say blacks and whites you know like that there's no Hispanics and Asians and other people <laughs> yeah um uh, the now watch this let's take the whites but the whites are people that came from different parts of Europe you know what I'm saying there's uh like you know there's Norway Norwegian there's Sweden, there's uh, Poland, there's, you know, different countries in Europe of different people from different places, you know what I'm saying, that are, you know, Caucasian. And the thing is, they're different. There's difference in that idea of whites, you know what I'm saying? And now let's go to Africa. Of course, you know, there, there's different countries, Niger, Ethiopia. Kenya, uh, all kind of different uh, countries in that concerning different black people. There's different black people there. You know what I'm saying? If you go to, uh, to and you know the cool thing and the crazy thing about this different thing, that we're created uh, different concerning DNA. You know what I'm saying? Different between DNA structures. You know what I'm saying? Everybody got a different DNA. You know, handprint, footprint, whatever. See all this difference that has been established in reality that we need to consider concerning, you know, the ideal of love. That, you know, that the ideal of love is based upon creation. That, like I'm saying, I'm going to bring it back to you again, proton and neutrons. Two different things coming together. Zoo, 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 zoo. That is establishing everything. And the thing is, there's different everywhere. Everywhere is different. You know, I can go keep going. The India, the, you know, China, you know, Asian people. There's Taiwan. There's, you know, uh, Chinese, Japan. You know what I'm saying? There's so many different uh, things that are created in the world, different animals, different species, don't want to go to animals. That's just too much, you know, <laughs> too much. You know about that, you know, mm -hmm. different species of everything. And with all this difference, yet the ideal structure that is supposed to be operated, if it's going to facilitate itself, has to be done you know, become one. It has to become one together. It has to, you know, uh, the difference has to become one as in, in line with the ideal of creation. And like, you know, like I said, negative charge, positive charge. Bam, has to create a battery that will contain energy. Therefore, that if that is the reality of how things are created, therefore different love is energy. And love is bringing forth different things. And male, female, boom, energy, different. Now, like, you know, I tell if there is a plus plus battery out there that can produce energy, let, let me see it. If there's a minus minus battery that can produce energy, let me see it. But that ideal concerning the uh, reality of how everything is created uh, is how it is. It is what it is. And the thing is, if we, 
but if it's not that, then there's a problem. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody's like looking at the world and we are busy looking at things and accepting problems instead of not trying to deal with the problem. You know what I'm saying? Concerning and see it as a problem. But everybody, of course, the world system is trying to make people accept the reality of, of problems. You know what I'm saying? And that is conflict in reality of nature. And it's, it's not, and, and if it continues to be in conflict in the reality of nature, it's going to create a disaster. It's going to create destruction. Because this is about, I presented to you, is about construction, concerning a difference bringing construction. But if it's the same, it will bring construction to the makeup of humanity. You know, if it's the same. I know yeah, you might like, oh, Mac, you just making a point because you don't like, you know, gays and whatever. So, no, I'm just presenting reality of the how everything is created differently. Differently can only become equal as one to becoming a true energy. And the thing is, it, God did not create the same, the same, boom, you know, the same. You know what I'm saying? He, it did not work. Right. But he created everything different that through the difference, you know, you can, you know, uh, become one. Now, God was going to show me this about the ideal of the homosexual ideal. You know what I'm saying? But he told me he told me that it's really what that is, is uh, two people, you know, two man and man, woman and woman. Of course, a man and a man will know what a woman, I mean, men will understand what a man desires. And it's really a friendship really went overboard. And a woman and a woman is a friendship that went overboard. Went overboard the borderlines of nature. You know what I'm saying? And the thing is, people are not looking at that. Is that is going overboard the borderlines of nature that it, it will not prosper concerning the idea of how everything is created that I am talking about. Not making my own opinion. This is not my own opinion. This is the reality of how everything is established that I am presenting. Hope you understand that. Um, the thing is that, you know, and we're, and, but if there's a problem, that means someone needs to address a situation. Where, where has the problem came from? What, what perceived the problem? Well, I know what perceived the problem. I know that, you know, Satan and his deception has deceived many and in the spirit because, you know, no, it's the world don't believe, don't talk about Satan. The world don't believe that he exists, you know. And the thing is, he is conniving and manipulating people and every generation, he's conniving and manipulating people, getting territory to places that he has no business. Now, I see people... I want to make a point about something, about uh, that, because everybody like to blame God because everything's bad. Uh, not saying, and I tell people, Genesis 126 says that men was given pretty much uh, responsibility, pretty much power, more likely responsibility of what's going on in this world. This, If there's going to be problems in this world, it's going to be based upon the, the responsibility of mankind. Not a God. God gave them that. Uh, here's y'all planet. Here it is. But the thing is, we're not, you know, uh, questioning the source, what could cause this problem. We're busy allowing a problem, you know what I'm saying, to facilitate itself and, and grow into every generation, 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 and accepting the wrong idea of what's going on. But the thing is, what the truth is that I'm revealing to you, that love is an energy. And love can only establish in energy. And love can only make sense in the energy. But anything else contrary to that is nonsense. And it's not going to produce the true result of what the reality is all about concerning what life is supposed to be. All right, that's the topic of the message. I hope you understand it. To God be the glory.